kind of crazy. Everything's closed. Saturday afternoon, June 6th. It's about 1 o'clock in the afternoon. And everything is closed. That is nuts. Everything is closed. Bottom stores. Just a couple stores that are open, but not very many. This place used to be popping, but it looks like it's like after hours or something. But everything. Sephora's closed. The pretzel place they always give out free samples is closed. Lens Crafters is closed. Earthworks, that place. Forever 21. JC Penney's. JC Penney's, which is like the last store always open in the mall, is closed. This is just crazy. That place is closed. The few places that are open usually have a line. I mean, even Victoria's Secret's closed. Disney stores closed. Sunglass Hut's closed. Or Sephora again. They're closed. It's weird, man. All the there's a couple of kiosks, but most of the kiosks like that one down there, that one's usually pretty hopping. Um, I don't know, it's like, like a dead mall. Alright, you told you guys Penny's was closed? JC Penny's. And bridge over there is all closed and boarded up. Sees candy. You probably can't see it's below me because I'm on the upper level. They're closed. There's a lot of stores that are closed. This place, I think they went out of business. They used to do like little cupcakes and cookies and stuff. They're closed. There's a few people that are here. Most people are just kind of walking around and stuff. They're like Hollister down there is closed. Hot Topics open. With Dead Bath and Body Works. Closed. Children's Place down there. They're closed. American Eagle. They're closed. GameStop's closed. Come over here to the other side. This place used to be Waffle Jeff, you know, they changed their name to the Cookie Plug or something. They're closed. GameStop, American Eagle Outfitters, they're closed. Remember Fast Times at Ridgemont High? I used to have a pair of vans like that. Can I get them today? No, because they're closed. Van store is closed. Wetzel's Pretzels, they're closed. Foot Locker's open. A couple of the stores are open, not, not very many. Yeah, this is a very expensive place to be. So if your store is closed, it's going to be closed for a while. And then some of the stores that are open, either they have a line or there's nobody in there. The Verizon store over there, they're closed. Foot Locker over here is closed, they only have one open. See, all that, all down there, everything's closed. A lot of places closed. Crazy times. Crazy, crazy times. See the Verizon store? They're closed. Everything's closed. Place the escalators over here working. The other ones look like they had them taken apart to do some work on them. Now this is. Look at me, I'm mall chuchin. All the major jewelry stores over there on the end are closed. Closed. It's, it's weird. Cinnabon over there. Look at 
Cinnabon is closed. What is that? Maui Ice, where they do Dole Whips and stuff. They're closed. A few food places are closed. Medical scrub store is closed. Nail salon is still closed. It's kind of crazy. Crazy, crazy time. All right. We got the doors wide open. And I think it's time to go. There's nothing going on. Got things to do. Just want to get, show you guys kind of what it's like. There's a lot of parking out here, as you can see. The parking garage, there's like nobody in there at all. Usually, where this is at, that parking garage will be packed full. I mean, packed, 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 full of people. But everything's closed. So there's no reason. People are coming here, I guess, just to get out of the house and walk around. So I've been seeing mostly just people kind of walk in the big loop of the mall, but... Nothing's really open. So everything's closed. I parked over here, but let me get a shot of the parking structure. This is kind of weird. This is really bizarre when you look over here. So like I'm saying, this place, it's June. It's, uh, this time of the year, people would have already been buying gifts for graduations and stuff. Well, there's a few cars in there, but usually this, this place over here is packed. It is usually packed full of people. But as you can see, it's, it's pretty empty for a Southern California mall, especially on a Saturday in June. People be shopping for gifts for graduation, or if they got gift cards, they'd be at the mall spending them. They'd be hanging out with their friends, making plans for the summer, deciding what they're going to do. Um, they would just be doing all kinds of stuff. But I mean, times are times are different. Times have definitely changed. There's a couple cars. There's, Usually this whole parking lot is full. And this parking garage is three stories. And usually you gotta go way out to the back 40 to get a spot this time of the year. Or Christmas time. Let me go upstairs. And I'll show you what I mean. Good exercise, climb those stairs, right? Climb those stairs. Check this out. Usually over there is a place called Terrace Cafe. That place will be packed. The umbrellas will be out. The place will be packed. There's people eating. This whole parking lot, all these spots will be filled up. I think these are probably worker cars. But look. This place would be solid. You'd see cars go, coming through here, driving around, trying to find a spot to park. And this is, this is the second story. Like I said, the third story is pretty packed, usually. But with, with the COVID, see, right there, second, second floor, in case you guys didn't believe me. The free, I don't know if you can see the freeway from here or not. Yeah, you probably can. Get over there. It's buzzing along pretty good, but usually the freeway is pretty busy. Yeah, it's yeah, you don't need to see the freeway. You know what freeways look like. Let's go to the third story. It's a little bit overcast today. It's not too bad. It's Probably high 70s. 
Get a little bit of the clouds, June gloom. Yeah, this gives you a pretty good idea. The traffic's just buzzing. Usually it's just solid. Top speed right out oh, this time of day would be about 30, 35. The cars that are slowing down over there are getting the off ramp. But all those cars, that would be like solid usually. Up here, like I said, I should have brought my skateboard today. Almost year round, this place is at least halfway packed. Not a single car up here. It's crazy, let me tell you. I know I said crazy a lot. Not a single car up here. Um, like I said, that's really, there's some cars that are gathered here, but there's a lot of spots that are open. Some cars over there, because there's a couple food places that are open finally for sit down. There's a couple of sit down places in there that are open. A couple, like two clothing stores, Foot Locker, some other places. Uh, TGI Fridays, they're closed too. Everything's just... So, I don't mean to be all doom and gloom, but everybody says we're on the road to recovery. We still got a long ways to go. Hopefully these businesses will be able to recover and people will be able to go back to work. And hopefully there won't be a, a second wave of the COVID, but... Who knows, you know? But like I said, this place is usually... Right now, I would have usually had to have put my camera down because people would be walking. See, I think these are probably more workers and staff. I see a lot of people going around with... Uh, mops and buckets and spray bottles and rags wiping things down after some so at least they're trying to keep the place clean and safe and that crow is getting on my last nerve but there's you know more worker cars but like all the way down there all this would be packed out on the street up there there'd be cars up on the street that's It's usually how you have to shut them up. You can see all this empty. It's just, it's crazy, crazy, crazy times. Again, like I said, this is Saturday. In June, it's, you can see it's not nighttime. The sun's starting to come out from the clouds. It's probably, like I said, it's about 1 32 o'clock, somewhere in that neighborhood. In this place, there's nothing going on. Nothing going on at all. I like my shirt. I'm just skin and bones, brother. I got a couple shirts like this. I really like this shirt. I don't remember where I bought it, Hot Topic or somewhere. I think it's cool. I like the bones. You know, I've always been into like science and anatomy and that kind of stuff. Not the, not the gothic, whatever. I don't know the gothic. Some of the gothic stuff's cool. I don't know. I don't try to pin myself down to any kind of category. I just wear what's comfortable, what looks good. Try not to be like everybody else. Just a t-shirt and jeans kind of guy. I think most of my shirts that I have, probably about 75-80% of my shirts are probably black or dark blue. I don't have very many light shirts. Just because I'm so emo. <laughs> but that's about it. Like I said, this place up here, that place would usually be be packed full of people but today not so much so much just wanted to give you guys a quick shot of all this stuff that's going on at the local the local mall 
They revamped it quite a few years ago. It used to be single story. So they made it two story and got more businesses in here. And they started building more stuff onto it. But now there's a lot of stuff that's going on where a lot of these businesses look like they're probably going to have to have to close down and didn't see that a lot where I'm at. There's a lot of places that used to be doing pretty good, not doing really, really good, but doing okay enough to keep the doors open and stuff. But now they're all closed. A lot of uh, this place is available for lease signs and other stuff like that. So that's about it. All right, I'm getting into my car, as you can see. I am in my car. And I will see you guys real soon with more videos. Have a great day. I'll see you guys real soon. Bye-bye. And my scars from the other day, they healed up pretty good. I'm not all bloody like it was. So I feel pretty good about that. So have a great day. See you guys later. Bye-bye.